Hello, I'm Douglas Samuel from www.windows7report.com. In this video, we're going to take a brief look at customizing the desktop. The easiest way to customize the desktop is to right click on the desktop and then select Personalize. The first thing you'll see is a collection of themes. These include background images for the desktop, audio, and a number of other things. Now, I quite like the beta fish that comes with the beta version of Windows 7, which is what I've got selected here. Now, if I select Architecture, I don't know if you heard the sound there, but the sound scheme has changed, and so have the background images. Yes, more than one. If you look down here, it says Slideshow, and that means that each image is going to cycle through on the background, making your desktop more interesting. Let's take a closer look. You'll see here the architecture theme, and you can see a collection of six images, and the upper left corner has a checkbox indicating that this is included on your desktop as part of the rotating image sequence. Down here on the left, there's different options for how to treat images that don't exactly fit the desktop. Over here, we can decide how often the images should change. You can have them change very quickly, like every 10 seconds or less often, like once a day. And if you click shuffle, then they don't always go in the same order. So now let's take a look at the desktop and see how that looks. So first of all, we save changes. Since we didn't make any changes, that wasn't really necessary, but anyways, now go and close this window, and you can now see the desktop has changed. Just to give you a better idea, let's go back and change the slideshow so that it rotates every 10 seconds. That'll make it a bit more interesting. So we'll go to the change picture every and select 10 seconds and save changes and close this window and let's take a look. I'll edit out the gap so that you don't have to wait 10 seconds for it to change. Now to go back to what we had before, we'll right click the desktop, click personalize and go to the Windows 7 theme and close that window and we're back to the beta fish. I hope you've enjoyed this video about Windows 7. If you haven't done so already, please visit my website at www.windows7report.com. Sign up for the free list and you'll receive a link to a new free video every week. I'm Doug Samuel. Bye for now.